The cult British sitcom Mind Your Language debuted on ITV in 1977. It was produced by London Weekend Television, and Stuart Allen directed it. Vince Powell created and wrote the show. The show was known for its witty humor and hilarious dialogue. London Weekend Television produced three seasons between 1977 and 1979, and the show was briefly revived in 1985 with six of the original cast. The series depicts students from many countries, religions, backgrounds and languages learning English as a foreign language in the same classroom. Mind Your Language is set in a London adult education college and centers on a teacher Mr. Jeremy teaching English as a foreign language to a group of foreigners who have enrolled in that school. Barry Evans starred as Mr. Brown in all 42 episodes, as a sincere, good-natured teacher who is always ready to take up the challenge of teaching English to these vain students. A theatre artiste who also did a few movies, Mind Your Language was Barry Evans' most memorable role. On February 9, 1997, the cops found 53-year-old Evans' dead body in his living room. Earlier that day, his car was stolen. The police had come to his house to inform him about the car being retrieved when they found him unresponsive. Till today, the cause of death is not known. A will was found close to his body and so was a small packet of intact aspirin tablets. The coroner found head wound on his person and alcohol was found in his bloodstream. It looked like someone had hit him and ran away. An 18-year-old man was arrested but let off due to any incriminating evidence. Golam Dino Shafiq played the role of Pakistani, Ali Nadeem, in Mind Your Language. He was a Bangladeshi British actor. He was a well-known character actor who acted in many sitcoms in the 70s and early 80s. Shafiq died of a heart attack in London on 10 March 1984, 11 days before his 54th birthday. Albert Moses was a Sri Lankan actor who played the role of the Punjabi student Ranjit, in Mind Your Language. In the show, he got popular catchphrases like, a thousand apologies and, most certainly. He died in September 2017 in London at the age of 79. George Camilla played the role of the Italian Catholic chef Giovanni Capello. He is an English actor. His catchphrases, holy ravioli, and okie koki, became popular. Born in 1941, the actor lives in Surrey, England. Kavork Malikian, the English-Armenian actor played the role of a Greek shipping agent Maximilian Papandrius. In the show, he is close friends with Giovanni. He tends to use H to every word that he says. The actor born in 1943, still does character roles. Ricardo Montes, this English actor played the Spanish bartender Juan Cervantes. He is known for his jolly colorful attitude, and is known to be quite confident of his answers, even though he is wrong most of the time. His catchphrases, Sul right, and, poor for war, please, became quite popular. At age 87, Montes died of cancer in Marbella, Spain, on October 26, 2010. Robert Lee, the Chinese actor played the role of Japanese electronics executive, Taro Nagazumi. He works for a Japanese fictional electronics company in London called Bushido. Though he speaks English well, he has a penchant of using O oh to almost every word he says. For example, Big Ben O oh, or Special O. Oh. He bows whenever his name is called and replies with R ah, so whenever he acknowledges anything. Robert Lee never married. He died in Hampstead, London aged 73 and December 1, 1986. Pick Sen Lim. This Malaysian British actress was the go to actor for Chinese roles in British television in the 70s and 80s. In Mind Your Language, Pik Sen Lim played the role of Chinese communist woman who works as a secretary at the Chinese embassy. In the shown, she is known to be immensely protective of China and Chinese policies. She always quotes Chairman Mao in the class. The actor Pik Sen Lim was also famous as the killer cleaner in Johnny English, 2011. The actress is 78 years old as on 2023. Jamila Massey played the role of Jamila Ranja, an Indian housewife from Shimla. In the show, Jamila is an Indian who hardly knows any English in the beginning but proves to be a fast learner. She is shown knitting most of the time in class. Jamila Massey is a British actor and writer, with Indian roots and has been acting since the 60s.
She lives in Wales with her husband and is in in her late 80s. Françoise Pascal. She played the eye candy of the class, the Frenchwoman Danielle Favre. She plays the French au pair. She is flirtatious and amorous by nature and is pursued by Giovanni and Max. She seems to have the hots for Mr. Brown. Françoise Pascal is a British actress who was born in 1949. She is also a singer and a dancer who made her music debut in 1968. Pascal produced a movie called Cold Sun in 2021. Jackie Harding. Jackie Harding played the role of Anna Schmidt, a West German student who works as an au pair. Apart from having a heavy German accent, Anna is hardworking and relatively brighter than the rest of the students. She is physically strong and doesn't stand flirting by male students. Jackie Harding, an accomplished actress, turns 90 years of age in 2023. Anna Bergman, the 1948-born Swedish actress known for her oomph and comedy roles, played the role of Swedish au pair Ingrid Stevenson in Mind Your Language. She is very attractive and many male students have a tough time avoiding their gaze from her. At the same time, she finds a rival in Danielle Favre. Anna Bergman is in her mid-70s and stays in Stockholm with her husband. Iris Sadler. She played, Gladys, the friendly tea lady in the school cafeteria in the show, Mind Your Language. Iris was an English actress who died on January 12, 1991, age 82. Tommy Godfrey. He played the role of Sydney, the caretaker and cleaner of the school. Sydney is an interesting character who talks in rough cockney, loves his alcohol, dislikes his partner, is hard of hearing and steals office supplies whenever he gets a chance. Tommy Godfrey, the English actor was born in 1916 and died in the year 1984, age 68. Zara Nutley. She played the role of Dolores Courtney, the no-nonsense principal of the school. She seems to have a dislike for men in particular and think that women are superior to men. She tends to drop by the English classroom and take impromptu session of the class, only to be disappointed by the overall performance of the class. Zara Nutley, a veteran actress, won a lot of praise for her role as a principal. Nutley died age 92 in Uckfield, East Sussex in October 9, 2016.